Now, are you faced with, in your organization, a scenario where sales reps aren't coming to sales trainings or sales meetings on time? Or if they do, maybe they're taking it from their car and are not you know, fully present. What's crazy in the example that I'm sharing with you is, you could do all the work and focus on everything around sales performance and improving results and even have a tremendous impact on those results like we are with this client. But what I can share with you is that kind of behavior must be coached. A sales leader must hold his reps accountable to their actions and a standard of showing up on time and valuing their teammates' time and energy and effort. And the whole outcome of sales leadership is to breed little mini sales leaders who are taking extreme ownership of their business as if it were their own. So I just wanted to share with you because in sales, we're always looking at what's the challenge we're trying to solve. And inevitably, right, 99% of the time, it's sales performance and results. But the truth of the matter is, studies show that a lack of sales leadership has a profound impact on overall results. So even if you're growing, these studies will show that a team that has effective sales leaders that's spending 80% or more of their time coaching and holding reps accountable to a higher standard are gonna generate twice as much sales as a team who does not. So I'm curious, how does this topic resonate with you as a business owner, CEO, a sales leader, or a sales professional yourself? Would love to socialize this in the comments below and see if there's something here that you would agree on this topic. All right, I look forward to seeing you in the comments.